Let's make something delicious, tasty, yet juicy. Keep watching. hello hello beautiful people how is it going it's your girl claudia and i'm back with another easy simple delicious tasty yet savory grilled fish recipe if you're new here hit the subscribe button you're gonna love it here these are the ingredients we will be using and of course i will be using my royal tea so pepper sauce this i will be using as a marinade a basting sauce and a dip guys this pepper sauce is the heat it is amazing super tasty when you got this you don't need any other spices or ingredients so guys keep watching ahead and i will be showing you how to use that pepper sauce so guys this pepper sauce it comes in mild hot and extra hot check the description box and i will drop the link for you guys to purchase and it's going to be delivered straight to your doorstep isn't that amazing so hurry up and grab one so to start off we want to score our fish the fish has been of course it has been scaled and gutted perfectly washed you want to score make sure you cut that deep till it touches the bone okay what I'm going to do, I will first of all season with some seasoning powder. I'm using bouillon here. And so guys, for our royal tea so pepper sauce, it already has everything. So this step is going to be optional, okay? So guys, you know, I will never ever refer something bad to you. This pepper sauce is actually good. It is perfect. It is savory. So hurry up and grab one all right so right now i will add in some oil guys seriously i was not even supposed to add in oil because the pepper sauce alone already had a lot of oil so feel free to skip this part okay so what you want to do right now we are going to marinate with the pepper sauce this is not really spicy but if you want the spicy one you can go for the extra hot so now go ahead marinate that make sure it goes deep into those slits cooking with Claudie. so now cover and let it rest for at least 30 minutes to an hour the longer it marinates the better to move on for my side i will be using some ripe plantains you want to peel that and slice if you want you can fry roast or broil the plantains use any side of your choice okay you can use fries or whatsoever cooking with Claudie, easy simple recipe ah, cooking with Claudie, cooking with Claudie. To season the plantain still with our royal tea so pepper sauce oh my god there guys this is a multi-purpose sauce it goes for everything everything whatsoever so i'm just gonna season that with some of the sauce and i'm going to be air frying this like i said if you want to deep fry go ahead and cook it any way you want so this is going to air fry for about 400 degree fahrenheit for 30 minutes make sure you flip sides halfway through after about 30 minutes, I'm going to transfer my fish onto my grilling pan or my broiling pan right there. It has been marinating for a while now. Bring in some fresh lemon slices and thyme inside the belly of the fish. Do not miss this part, okay? This is going to bring out a lot of flavor from your fish. Just imagine the lemon, thyme, and the royal tiso pepper combined together. Oh, lordy, lordy, lordy. That's going to be amazing. So now go ahead and put that in the belly of the fish and it's going to go to a, a preheated oven, 400 degree Fahrenheit, 10 minutes each side, in total 20 minutes. So now the scrapings of the pan, I'm just going to apply it on the fish, then it's going to go to the oven right away.
So this is going to go to the oven 400 degree Fahrenheit on broil or roast or grill 10 minutes each side. So make sure you take out the fish every five minutes and bask with some of the royal tea so pepper sauce, okay? At this point, I'm going to flip the sides. Once you flip the sides, you want to bask the other side, then it's going to go to the oven for the final 10 minutes. Same 400 degree Fahrenheit. And so guys, after the time, this is how amazing it's looking. Look how that pepper sauce is on that fish, guys. Don't you want to like have one of that? It is so affordable. So you can get it from the website. Don't forget to check out the website. Like I always tell you in my videos, any perfect marinade is supposed to have oil enough oil to maintain the juiciness of the fish just like the royal tiso pepper sauce does so make sure you grab one and see you in my next video bye for now and take care